The Sound of Freedom. Probably my longest review, but worth it. Stay till the end. This is one of the most important movies that'll come out this decade. Oppenheimer is definitely the best movie of the year, but this is way more important and impactful. There were parts in this where I could hear grown men crying in the theater. I went on a Tuesday night at 10.30 and it was packed. It's about child sex trafficking across the world and the pedophiles that kidnap them and buy them. It's about a homeland security agent that risks it all to go save a little boy and a little girl. This is based on the true story of Tim Ballard. I was so fucking angry watching this movie. There were parts that pissed me off. It made me feel something. Everyone should watch this and be outraged too. Hopefully, collectively, we can start to affect change in child human trafficking across the world, not just here in America. The way the movie ended is a fucking chef's kiss because it just feels like another day. Nothing changed, nothing happened. The facts that they actually drop before the credits are crazy. It is worth just that. At least the list of all the people that were on Epstein's island and prosecute to the fullest. Dead pedophiles don't reoffend, and maximum sentences on anyone who commits child sex acts should be a must throughout the country. Those are the laws that should be getting passed way before NIL deal bullshit. Like Disney tried to bury this movie. Now all their child stars are coming out and being more vocal and open about the abuse that they've had to deal with for the last 20 years. It's not just people snatching kids from the streets. Everyone thinks this could never happen to me or my children. In the movie, there's a part where a famous girl is posing as a talent agent and kidnaps the kids after she says she can help them get modeling gigs and into acting. I have literally been in a room like that with my sister when I was a kid. Reading lines for some semi-famous person to get a shot in the industry. Nothing actually happened to me or my sister, but watching that reminded me that it could have been me. I've been in that situation. This gets a 9.9 .9 on social impact alone. Everyone should watch this movie and start lobbying for stricter laws to protect the children and keep pedophiles in jail as long as possible or bring back public hangings. The fact that this is hitting 100 mil plus in theaters off of basically word of mouth says a lot. I'm glad I paid to see this. The war on drugs is bullshit. The people that want drugs are paying for them and still paying for the privilege to kill themselves. Fuck it. We need a war on pedophiles and sex trafficking. That's what's really hurting our society. This is probably my longest review because I could stand on a soapbox and fucking scream about what the fuck is going on for days. Maybe I fucking hit up my congressman and start pushing for the change that I want to see in the world because I got the fucking time. This is Swerve. I watch so you don't have to, but you definitely should. The Sound of Freedom.